Hello everyone, happy Friday. Hope we're all doing great today. I'm playing more Dead Space. This time we're doing New Game Plus. I completed the Impossible Mode difficulty playthrough last night on our first attempt. I wasn't expecting to make it through on the first attempt, but we did it. And so now we're going to go through the game again and try to get the secret ending that you can only get in New Game Plus, apparently. We're going to be using the hand cannon as well. Because we completed the game on Impossible Difficulty, we have that new weapon. We also get a special suit we can wear. And all the while, I'm going to be working on getting as many nodes as possible, so that way we can upgrade all the other weapons for the final few achievements in the game. Heck yeah. I'm ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Happy Friday, folks. Who do I see in chat? I see Eric, Srebov, Ludo, Majin Kai, Rory, Luis, Asuka, Mifit Blue, uh, Mike is here. Hello, Winter. Queen Ganyu. I see Decreasing Mass, McDanian. Happy Friday. P Bala 5. Happy Friday. What's up, Spartan? Hello, Terry Rose. I also see JR 2.0. Hello there. Mike Event. Hello. What's going on, everyone? How are we doing? What's up, gang? Hey, Suzanne. Hello, guys. Snowboards, what's up? Linda, hello. Flackitude, hello. Hope you're all doing great. So let's go ahead and get this started, shall we? New Game Plus. You can see I've completed the game twice now uh, on Impossible and Hard. I'm going to continue our Impossible Mode difficulty. Um, impossible Difficulty Mode, however you want to say it. Starting a New Game Plus will carry over weapons, items, credits, and upgrades from your completed playthrough. They can be retrieved from the storage of any store you encounter. You can expect to face new enemies and perhaps find new mis mysteries to uncover. What's up, Brian? What's up, Esther? Hey, Avalanche, Mel, and Screamer. Okay, we're going to keep it on impossible. All right, I, I completed the last impossible playthrough in eight hours and 36 minutes. Not bad. I, I'm, it's kind of cool that, that it shows that. That's that's nice. Extremely difficult mode aimed at elite dead space veterans. Oh, yeah, I guess I'm an elite veteran, guys. Look at that. Thanks, game. Thanks, game. Not bad at all. Yeah, um, not bad. Eight and a half hours. Hey, Mark. Hey, Barge. It's going to be more difficult. Um, this playthrough will be easier than the previous one because I'm also going to have a very strong weapon called the hand cannon. But I'm just leaving out an on impossible difficulty just to see if uh, if I'll die. If I do, it'll stay on hard mode after that. It's fine. I've already completed it on this difficulty, so I'm not too concerned about actually surviving. You know. Strange. Such a little thing. Hey, Juka. That's her. Nicole. Yeah. First I've heard from her in weeks. It's going well, Jr. How are you? Got that thing on repeat. Guess you really miss her. We all knew you'd do it. We weren't, we weren't waiting for Isaac to die. <laughs> there was some people saying, oh man, I can't wait for you to die. Some people wanted me to start over and stuff. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hamlet recite security. What's up, Crashy? So you keep saying. Here we go. Nice clean re-entry. Hey Janet. Scarecrow, hope you're well, dude. Guys, thank you all for tuning in today. Staring at that chunk of rock. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now, where is she? There. Confirming visual contact with USG Ishimura. USG Ishimura. Home. Find a cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already hey Kai work. why is it so dark we should be able to see your running lights in a long time yeah. since I've seen you well it's good to have you here Linda I do stream most just days of the week approach. still it's just a matter of a lot of people don't get recommendations or uh no notifications if I don't stream Elden Ring so that might be why you track your file hey Janikin what's up Isaac's stuck in horror loop I know he's like this is the Your third time I've been here this week Want to work in the big league. Hey, Robert. Play ball. <clears throat> What's all the debris? Um, so the Ishimura is what's called a planet cracker ship. 
which means that it literally pops large chunks of land off of planets in order to uh, expedite mining. So that way, you know, they can get resources and uncover things under the ground faster. And when they do that, it pulls up a bunch of, you know, smaller debris throughout, uh, you know, in the upper atmosphere as well. Have I finished Deathloop? Yes, I have. That's a good game, actually. Deathloop is surprisingly good. It's why, like, even though I'm not super hyped on Redfall, I'm still going to try it out because Arcane Studios has not missed yet. Arcane Studios is actually really good at what they do. So I'm hoping that Redfall stands out to me as well. I saw you here, Kai. I remember. Losing control. We're on course. Daniel. Guidance system override isn't responsive. Shit. Shit. We're coming in too high. It's gonna smash us into the hall. Chance. Aim for that emergency stabilizer. There. The blue light. It might slow us down. Guys. Let's watch Isaac's face this time. You know what? Not bad. Not bad on those animations during that, actually. That was all right. Shit. But better than a broken neck. Or worse. Good call on the stabilizer, Isaac. Bet I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with What's up, maybe that Vegito? A death trap. Better add it to your repair. Hey, Galax. Jen, what's our damage? Hey, Mike Hale. Love the vids. Don't know if you've seen my earlier comment. Don't know if you're aware that Square Enix blocked Valkyrie Elysium Episode 17. Yeah, they blocked it the day it came out, and I still don't have an answer as to why. I haven't re-uploaded it because I don't want to risk getting a strike on my channel. Generally speaking, if they go out of the way to straight up block the video from being visible, that means if you try to re-upload it and they see it, then they will generally uh, give your channel a strike. Which is kind of a problem. I don't want to do that. I don't want to risk that. So unfortunately, I just have to leave it as is. I'm sorry. I just don't want to risk getting my channel, you know, a bad reputation over something like that. As much as it sucks. They blocked two videos that day. It was episode 17 or part 17 of that playthrough, as well as my all boss video as well. Johnson might disagree. What? You're offering to buy the first round of that. I wouldn't mind something to study. What's wrong with that episode? My thought was because it showed like the ending or one of the endings of the game, they just got rid of it for spoilers. I don't know. What's up with the horns? This was the suit that I was wearing at the la at the end of my last playthrough. And because this is New Game Plus on the same save, they just kind of kept it going. Bummer? Yeah, I'm sorry, Mike. It really sucks. I wish it weren't that way, but there's not much I can do. My hands are tied. Well get in. Happy Friday, Biggie. What's up, man? Totally understand. I'm glad you do, dude. I'm glad. It's actually the first time that that's ever happened on my channel here on YouTube. Um, I'm hoping that it's not a regular thing, but all the same, it is what it is currently. Ah, health. Very good. Happy Friday, folks. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for pressing the like button. Location. Hope you guys are ready for more Dead Space action, this time with the hand cannon. Seen the infected suit in cutscenes where you take off the helmet? I have. Yeah, you're actually headless when you do it. Your head is still inside the helmet. It's kind of funny. Yeah, I'm doing all right, man. I'm doing all right. Thanks, Biggie. Hey, Nerf Herder, what's up? <laughs> There's a term I haven't heard in a while. Nerf Herder. Yeah, we do also have the level six suit Where's and a special your... suit skin for completing the impossible difficulty. So as soon as There's we get to a store, we're going to try that on. No power to the elevator. Never played Dead Space, to be honest. This makes me kind of want to. It's a great game, Mike. A it's a great game. Isaac, get a damage report. I'm done playing around. <laughs> it's Saturday for me because I'm 12 hours ahead of you, so I'm chatting with you from the future. How's the future looking, man? 
How is the world 12 hours from now? Are we still good? Everyone still alive? Oh god, that smell. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. It's not just comms or the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Shit, Engines, man. Hull, the tramps. You could do that kind of damage to a planet cracker. <laughs> Up. Hey Adam, what's up, man? Activated. Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Did you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. Yeah, man. Take it easy. Daniels, get those elevators. There's something in here with us. Up there! Behind you, Chen! Oh, well, too late. Is he okay? Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now. You've got red on you. Isaac, you've got red on you. Playing what difficulty level again? It's still on impossible. It's still on impossible. I have not died on impossible yet, so I figure let's just keep the train rolling until we do die. Why not? Shaun of the Dead is a great film. Agreed. As far as zombie films go, that and 28 Days Later would be my favorites. Rage. Rage. Oh, you know what? <laughs> this plasma cutter still has all my upgrades on it. I should have taken three times the amount of shots to kill it, but um, it kept the upgrades. And so, yep, very good. Very good. Everyone say hello to Jim. Here's Jim. Jim crossing. Do I like the quiet place? I've not seen it. Security request retrieved. What's up, Yippie Kaye? We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. We need to find the foam finger first. Nope, we just got to get to a store and then we'll be able to take it out of the uh, the storage there. Just takes a little time to get to that point. You made it. Just, they're everywhere. Shit, is he, uh, he's gone. Only for Platinum is the Impossible Trophy and I've just started at the same time as you. Pro tips, uh, take your time. Explore. Try to focus on just a few weapons so that way you can maximize your ammo potential. Look and them. make sure you always have yeah, multiple heals bridge. on you. There's Prioritize healing and ammo somewhere. always. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Outside of that, Everything just take every room slowly. And you're both repair techs. So how do we do this? There's if you would like to uh, have a complete playlist to play along with, I have two videos specifically on my channel already. I completed my impossible mode run in eight and a half hours. You can follow along with that. Just make sure there's power. If you would like like a, a, a thorough walkthrough. It's not 100% by any means, but it's pretty thorough. I didn't have a whole lot of difficulties. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. Hi, Jim. Bye, Jim. Yeah, it happened so fast. Jim came and Jim went. Phrasing. I got this? Hell yeah, Eki. 
Hell yeah, you do. I don't know how to get the secret ending, or is it completely blind? Um, I know that there's little marker fragments we have to get. And I have a suspected area in which we have to turn them in, but that's all I know, and I want it to remain like that. I want to figure it out. Did you guys know that if you shoot the baby dolls, they cry? Which way did he go? Okay, we, we, we want to go that way, but, uh, you know, the power's got to go out first. We have a power cycle. I'm going to check out this bathroom as soon as the, uh, you know, the power comes back. Happy Friday, TMO. Hope you're well. Now my dog is looking for a baby to come for, and I don't even have kids. That's how you know you have a good dog. That's how you know. Poochu, thank you for the five euros. You haven't been made whole yet? Glad to see more Dead Space content. Yeah, I'm not whole yet, man. I'm not whole yet. I gotta find all, all the fragments, and then we'll be whole again. Alright? We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. <laughs> thank you for the five euros, dude. I appreciate it. Is he already hallucinating? Um, No, I think that was just a power cycle. Isaac, don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head. Doesn't even slow them down. Okay. All right, first power note of the playthrough. Oh, he's hacking them apart. Those arms and legs. Does that even kill them? Or do they just stop moving? Oh, yes, the handlers. Yes. Yes, indeed. Repair systems, systems online. All right, we're going to have a couple of nerds popping out on our left and on our right. We'll take care of them. Warning. Just got to wait for this whole contact. tram thing. Please contact a repair technician. All right. You ready? Here we go. gonna be a couple more it's fine though we got this don't worry don't worry we're gonna handle it we're gonna handle it come on out or are they gonna come out from that side first they might come from the other side first actually because i am standing closer to this side ah nope okay Oh, if I may offer another suggestion, if you're playing through this game on impossible difficulty as well, um, no matter how tempted you are, like I was just then to try to chop off the arms first, try to go for the legs. Unless their legs are just armored up and it's hard to break them off. If you, if you have like the force gun, blow off the armor and then blow off their legs with a plasma gun or a line gun or whatever. But generally speaking, you should always try to chop the legs off first because it gives you a lot more time to, uh, to line up some more shots. Makes them a lot easier to hit. You got it. All that. The was jamming the whole system. That's one down. Sweep the leg is what I'm Seven saying. Board was fried too. Inventory Sweep the leg, chat. The maintenance bay. We can't run the trams without it. Zombie Apocalypse 101. Cardio 
and sweep the leg. Hey, Hammer Man says, I don't, I know you don't know me, but I want to let you know that I love you. Hey, I don't know you very well, Hammer Man, but I love you too, man. You seem, you seem kind. Thanks for tuning in. Have I told you lately? Fuck it. <laughs> Hey, you seem to lost uh, to have lost a hand. Are you okay? Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at his head. Look at his head go. Oh my god! How does how does your head even do that? What's y'all's favorite weapon in this game? Line gun for me. I love me the line gun. It's so fun. Ah, the old baggage hall. Right. You guys remember Jim, right? You guys remember Jim, the guy we said hello to earlier? Well, uh, it turns out he's actually over here taking a nap. Jim's taking a small nap. Let's go ahead and uh, wake him up. It's nap time forever, Jim. Goodbye. When you get to use the foam finger, as soon as I get to a store, I'll be able to take it out of storage. Hey, who lost a hand? Huh? Hey, um, I'm going to have to put in a small, a small complaints with the captain of the ship. Um, I, you know, it's just, it's really hard to get anything done when the walls are screaming, you know? I think we should do something about this. We really have to figure this issue out. Captain, the walls are screaming. What can we do about this? What's up, Ash? Jim wasn't hurting anyone? No, he wasn't. Not at the time, but he was about to. What's up, Matt? How's it going? How you doing, huh? Did you guys hear those footsteps? Definitely hearing more footsteps, but... They sounded like they were below me. Weird, because it's only supposed to be two enemies that come out. So why was I hearing footsteps there? Interesting. The blast of the explosions is much larger than what appears as well. The explosion radius is actually pretty generous outside of what you actually see. And that that person scares me every time I look over at this wall. Ooh, look, an item. Those footsteps were IRL? I certainly hope not, because that's also scary. Walls scream at you all the time, it's normal. Hey, have you, um, <laughs> have you talked to someone about that, Yasin? Have you talked to someone about that? Um, maybe some investigation should be done there? Hey, Sinte, hope you've been well, man. Good to see you here. May, hello there. I hope you're recovering well. I know it's, you know, the first day after and everything, but hope you're recovering well. Just the walls that are rude? Hmm. Hmm. I don't doubt you. 
the giant person scared the shit out of me my first time yeah dude i remember when i first walked into this room i was like oh my god what the hell are you Give me them monies. Give me them credits. Okay, you two are dead, but you're alive. Sente, thank you for the five bones. Hey, Josh, awesome job on this game. You gonna be playing Hogwarts Legacy 2? I will be. I'll be playing it on the 7th. I'll be live streaming it on the 7th. And I hope to have you here for it. Thank you for the five bones, man. It's good to have you back here. All right, what do we want to keep? Uh, lights or elevators? Or maintenance room? Well, we got to turn off the lights because I need the elevator. Hard choice to make there, huh? Hard choice to make. You'll be here? Sounds good, Sente. Looking forward to it. Yes, Rev. The sound design in this game is great. This door is open. We've got angry mans all around us. All right, that's an elite. Oh my god, that elite is still alive. Are you kidding me? I chopped both this man's legs off. He survived an explosion. He's still coming at me. What the heck, dude? That guy has a lot of health. Sir, you don't have the rights. Who gave that guy such a big health bar? Huh? There's a bench. There's our data board. Some credits. Oh, dude, that's one of the markers. Look at that. Get that out of the way. Marker fragment. That's our first one. marked achievement unlocked so these are the things that we have to collect on this playthrough guys this is something specifically new in new game plus we gotta find all of these to get the secret ending smooth gameplay yeah it's excellent man it's so good i have 25 nodes 25 nodes guys i'm gonna hold on to them i'm not gonna level anything up yet because i want to wait until we get the um the suit at the store. We're playing after this game. On the 7th, we have Hogwarts Legacy. You know, I probably could have just waited for him to get closer to the explosives there. You know what? Follow me, bud. Follow me. Right here. This is yours. Come get it. Gorgeous. Oh, yes. Who? Nap time. That was Jim's sister, Kim. Calling tram. It's clear. 
which house are you choosing i'm going to leave it to a vote on the uh on the sixth i'm going to put out a vote on the community tab and you guys are going to choose what house i play as Quarantine lockdown's lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Better be Slytherin, that's all I can say. Make sure you leave a vote on the 6th when it's time. What? Protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. We stick to procedure. We'll get through this. <sighs> we'll see. Evil awful puff playthrough. Yeah, we've already decided we are going to do a uh, a dark playthrough, so, you know, that's confirmed. We just have to choose the house from there. I'm going the wrong way. My mistake. I thought you've played this game before, Josh. What are you doing? Negative 40? Ooh. Living in Europe is actually negative 40 Celsius. Can't comprehend that temperature. How does one survive this? You know, um, it's an annual thing here in the U.S., even where I grew up in upstate New York, it would hit that sometimes. It's mostly wind chill, though. It's not like when people say that it's not oftentimes in the mainland, the, like the, the continental U.S. It's usually not that. Uh... <gasps> what the? Excuse me? What just happened? There was a body there. I look over here. I didn't actually. Did, did the guy? Did the body jump through there? Is that why that broke? What the hell just happened? Okay. Um. Ah! Ah! What? Are you going to disappear again? Like, what's going on? Okay, I thought I was losing my damn mind. Okay, yeah, there's some weird, weird shit going on. Okay. All right. Welcome back. Welcome back, Rob. Yep. Very good. Okay. Okay. But anyways, like I was saying, uh, Beta, it's um, usually when people in the continental US say negative 40, that generally implies uh, that's the, the feel with the wind chill. It'll still be, you know, below below zero temperatures, but usually imply it's implied that they that includes the wind chill as well. It's very rare in the continental US that it gets that low. Without the wind chill, that is. Not saying it doesn't happen because it can, I'm sure, but yeah. Oh my god, you're gonna break through there. Oh my god, and now there's gonna be one behind me. Hey, don't bamboozle me. I know how this goes. That's gonna pop out. Oh, they're changing it up on me. <laughs> is there one behind me as well then? There is. <laughs> Look at you. Look at you. Anyway. Is New York loud? I mean, it depends on the day. I mean, the, the city specifically is almost always loud. Yes. Uh, upstate New York, it just really depends on where you are within the states. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. You know? It's... All right, this is an elite. Yeah, Barge, yeah. Like, like I said, I'm not saying it doesn't happen, but it's not... It's usually implied that, uh, you know, if it goes down that low, it's often got wind chill involved as well. 
I think a lot of places in the States called it the real feel or something now. I don't know. This 80% speed run sucks. True. True. Is that blood? Haley, I need you to listen. Oh, thank you for clipping it, Adam. Maybe I can make a short out of it. The Ishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac. We need to kill the fixed now. Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there. You can't with that ankle. She died like she lived. Stuck on the damn ship. Hey, uh, this is our third elite already. I'll have you guys know this is our third elite on this playthrough already. And now I have, I have 10 rounds left. Isaac, what's happening down there? Justin's gone. I'm killing him too. The Singularity Corps overloaded. No. Kellyan was our only way home. We're trapped. No. I'm not losing two good people for nothing. What about the command computer? It's a brick. All the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Ooh, this guy's a bathroom. Speaking of, I have to okay, I have to use here. the bathroom already. Captain I have to pee. Location, medical. I have to pee, guys. I'm gonna do that real quick, okay? Alright. What's up, Drake Shot? How have you been, man? You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we What was that? Hey Flintox. <laughs> Wait, that's not Chen. Shit. <laughs> Chen, something's different about you. Did you get a haircut? We need a store. I think we're about to run into one now. As soon as this door opens here, as soon as the elevator stops, I'm going to pause it, run to the bathroom, and then I'll be right back. All right. Now, guys, while I'm away, I need you to do me a massive favor. There's a store. Um, do me a massive favor. Hit the like button. Okay? Really skyrocket those likes. I'll be right back.
All right, sorry about that, guys. I had to pee so bad. We're back. We're back, and I am ready for the hand cannon. I'm so ready. Schemat schematic submitted. Now, items now available for purchase. Suit level six, EDF rig. Oh my god, EDF. For 99,000. But in the storage, we have the hand cannon. So let me move this to inventory. Let me also move the line gun to inventory. And apparently we have a shitload of ammo. We'll take 25. Oh, I didn't mean to sell those. We'll take 25 just to have, but it's going to be mostly hand cannon here. And there's the burnished suit. The burnished. This is the suit that we get for completing the game on impossible difficulty, right? Pretty sure. The burnished suit. What's up, Ian? How you doing? Yasin, have a good night. I'll see you later. Oh, that looks sick. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. Now let's let's um let's sell some stuff here. We need to get ninety nine thousand. So you know, as powerful as stasis is, you you would think that they would give you less of these stasis packs, but they just really throw them at you nine non nonstop. They, they, they just give you far too many in a single playthrough. What's the hand item? That's the hand cannon. All right, that's pretty tight too. Yeah, we're going to rock this for a while. That's pretty tight, man. Okay. Okay. God damn. God damn. That's pretty damn sick. Look at that. Oh my god. Yep. We like that. Now let's go ahead and throw on the hand cannon. Yes. Take me seriously. Stop laughing. I will shoot. Put them up. Where's the necromorphs? Where are they? Take me seriously. I am a serious threat. <laughs> Does it take ammo? No, it's got infinite ammo. Bang, bang, bang. And then we have... Am I scary? Do I look like... Do I look like an Earth Defense Force soldier? It, it's too good. Yes, this was in the original game as well. It was. Um, I don't think we need anything else right now. I think we just uh, continue on. Yeah, let's continue on. Level suit, level six suit upgrade. 
Look at that, guys. Look at that. The grab range. The duration. The air. More duration. The kinesis throw damage. All right, our suit is maxed out. Plasma guns, our plasma cutters maxed out. So let's go ahead and just... Still too many nodes, man. Still too many nodes. Maxing out the suit first today. This is new game plus, so I have all the upgrades from my previous playthrough already. What's up, kitty? Gotta get back to work. We wanted to leave my like. Thank you for stopping by, even while you're at work. Hope you're having a good day. I will see you later. You had one more? That's okay. It's not really a big deal. We can go and uh, get that whenever. You know, I was hoping that we would keep our clearance on New Game Plus, but I understand why we don't. I was hoping you would just kind of let us hit it, though. Hey, Aquatic. Hey, Neo. What's up, guys? making sure I can still squeeze through there. Thanks, Neo. I appreciate it, man. You keep Master Override, though? I don't think so. I was going to ask if she needs a hand, but she's already got an extra one stuck inside of her chest there. Yeah, she's, she's, she's fine. It's all good. You do keep Master Override, though? Damn, I should have actually gotten it on my last playthrough then. If I had known that, I would have put in the effort to do so. Oh, well. It's not like it's hard to do. We'll just do it on this one. It's fine. Nope. Open. Pardon me. Pardon me. Oh my god, what the hell just happened? Camera? Relax. Isaac, have you heard from Daniel? We were no. attacked. She ran the other way. No, nothing. Oh, a bunch of slaughterhouse. They barricaded access to the morgue. The morgue? Yeah. But the barricade was put together in a hurry. The hydrazine tank might blow it open. Just need a detonator. Hey, like Matt, what's up, dude? Am I getting all achievements? Yeah, I'm working on it, Virgil. Yep. Isaac, the one who attacked us. I swear to God it was Chen. But I saw him die. If they barricaded the morgue, maybe it was to keep something in. Hmm. Hmm. Right. Uh, so I think the plan here is, guys, what I'm going to do is I am going to be putting a lot of my resources into upgrading all the weapons this playthrough. Not that I'll be using them a whole lot, if at all. But what I can do is every little bit of ammo that I find, I can essentially sell. So that way I can buy more power nodes. So that way I can better afford to get all the upgrades. Let's get that in our inventory. So we have that done. Uh, that one costs 11,500. So let's make that happen real quick. If I sell all the ammo that I find, I'll be able to get more power nodes, which means I'll be able to get more upgrades. Is 
Is this the best suit? It's the level six suit. Yeah, this is the max suit in the game. Something a lot of people do not realize, though, is you can you can go in here and look at the other suits in storage and you can equip any of these and still keep your uh, your level six stats. You can treat these all as basically skins. As you level up your suit, you keep the stats. You keep the, uh, you know, the increased stuff about them. But you can choose any of these to put on if you prefer that look. That is a thing you can do. Ludo, have a good night, dude. I'll see you later. Man's a real party animal. Oh, there's usually an item right there, no? Wasn't there a tank suit in OG with 60% armor? Um, I want to say that was Dead Space 2, right? You think he's dead? You think we got him? Yes, it's one hit kill. Yeah. Yeah. These are the things that you can get if you, uh, you know, beat the game on the hardest difficulty. Now, Suzanne, you said there was one more somewhere on one of these, right? Uh, was it on this one? No, it's not on that one either. I got all of them on the suits. I got these other ones on there. I think we're good. Oops. Get it? Spot on the left top corner? The left top corner of one. I've got them. I've got them. Maybe it was just the fact that it's like a when you hit enter, it takes like a whole second for it to actually appear. It's really weird. It's a little bit slow to actually appear there. So maybe I just exit out of the screen too quickly. The doors. One's missing in pulse rifle, pink square upgrade. Yeah, I know. Uh, I didn't have the pulse rifle at that point earlier, though. I don't have enough nodes now. I'm a mall out of nodes. We're at that point now. Uh, what security is that? Two. Yeah. Level two security clearance required. You saw it wrong. I, I was probably just moving it too quickly. Ah. Once I get really comfortable with the game, I just kind of start zooming through menus. Did I look in here already? I did. Hey, Nimrod. What's up, man? Any advice for impossible mode? Um, first bit of advice I would say is to take your time through the rooms. Just really take your time. Um, don't, don't run just to run. You want to make sure that you're, you know, Walk at a normal pace like this, so that way anything that does pop out, you can take care of immediately. And then when you take care of things immediately, you'll be able to open up yourself more time to take on increasingly large amounts of enemies as they happen. 
outside of that um if you do need a bit of a walkthrough to kind of help out you can use my recent playthrough on my channel of, of impossible mode difficulty that's an elite that just got one shot that indeed is an elite and it is very dead after one shot but yeah the, the first tip man just take your time take it slow take it easy explore every room to its fullest to make sure you're getting every last resource possible even if it's something that you don't need you can put it in storage and or sell it and there's nothing wrong with getting more than what you need when it comes to the hardest difficulties level two security clearance required Is there a cluster bomb kind of weapon? There's an upgrade for the line gun where you can put down three mines at once. But they're mines, not really like cluster grenades. That's about as clustery as I think can think about anything in this game. Matt! Matt. Matt, thank you for the gifted member to the community, man. Went out to Neo Bandit. Thank you very much for the gifted one, dude. It's very nice of you, man. Thank you so much for doing that. Neo, hope you enjoy the emotes you can use in chat and stuff, man. Thanks for being here. Thanks for gifting him one, Matt. Let's see those cult emotes out there for the new non-cult member and Matt. Thank you, man. Exiting vacuum. Exiting vacuum. Hey, Froshy, how have you been? It's good to see you today. I love the music that plays here while you hear all the lights activating in this room and you're going into zero G for the first time. That's just an epic moment right there, dude. Like an incredibly epic moment. Truly. It's like, oh, you know, it's like angelic. It's kind of sick. Yeah, Corey, the remake is gorgeous, dude. This is how you do a remake. Yeah. Exiting zero gravity. Redneck Ninja, thank you for the $10. Finally, I've been wanting a proper finger blasting from Juge for months. Oh, no, dude. Oh, God. Still holding this position. <laughs> What's happening there? <laughs> <laughs> Redneck, thank you for the 10, dude. I appreciate it, man. Thank you very much. Okay, work fast, Isaac. Entering zero gravity. Thank you very much for the 10, Redneck. What the hell? It shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. What is this weapon? This is the hand cannon. You unlock the hand cannon by completing the game on impossible difficulty. Which means you have to beat the whole game without dying. Does not consume any ammo? No. The, you, I know this is um th this this type of thing might break a lot of people's thoughts on how games work, but you have to think of how older games were built, right? In a lot of older games, including uh you know some as recent as Dead Space Two, when you complete the game on a harder difficulty, you get in-game rewards for doing so. And the reason I'm explaining this is because there's a lot of people that have never really experienced this before in a video game. This is something that has been happening, uh, that, that used to happen in games all the time when I was a kid growing up. 
When you complete a game with a certain character or on a certain difficulty or without dying or a combo of these effects, you'll often unlock stuff like this. And this is kind of a throwback to that idea. A lot of people would see this type of thing nowadays through like a microtransaction, but this game just rewards you for playing the game through certain paths. Now again, my intent is to not over explain, I, I just know that this is actually a, a new concept to many. I trapped him in a damaged escape pod. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. Pulse round schematics. Prestige rewards were just fun. It's sad it's not as common. I know, dude. I really miss it. It's why I'm playing this again. Uh, generally speaking, if I wanted the rest of these achievements, I would just kind of do it in my own time off stream. But I figure this is something that is actually worth sharing. Because this is like, this is not a common thing that happens in games anymore. It's kind of fun. Though, even though I'm on impossible difficulty still right now, as you can see. Select difficulty, you can see I'm still on impossible. This weapon, <laughs> it just trivializes the hell out of it for sure. All right, is this going back to where I think it is? Yes. Yes. Okay, good. One shot all of them? Yeah. Scuffed RE4 veteran. You know, you know what's crazy is um, RE4 Remake is coming out relatively soon. And um, I hardly remember that game. I do enjoy it a lot. And I've always called it my favorite Resident Evil. I remember just having the most fun with it out of all the Resident Evil games that I've played. But... Truly, I don't remember the majority of it. So I'm kind of looking forward to the remake just to kind of experience all this stuff again. That's going to be fun. The biggest thing I remember is Ashley screaming for Leon. Leon! Leon, save me! Leon! 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 I just remember thinking, dude, would you shut the hell up and let me play the game? Thanks. Hey, one above all, what's up? Playing the old version at this moment. Good luck. Right on, man. Another marker fragments. Big. So I wonder if we're gonna find these fragments in runes in rooms that have this these like writings on the wall. If that's the case of it, if that's the way of it, then I'll be able to really just kind of find majority of them very simply based on that. You can also see them in some of these holograms as well. You see this one here, and I know there's a couple Look, later on that I remember seeing them in as well. Interesting. Hey. 
What's up, Preston? I just still do the rocking animation with a finger. I believe that's only in Dead Space 2. Or was that in 3? I can't remember. It's been so long. Was it 3 that had the, uh... The other one? It might have been. Are you bold? If you're asking if I'm bald, the answer is yes. I am very bald. But I shave my head every two days. Because I have a terrible receding hairline. And I've had a terrible receding hairline since the age of 17. So, you know, it's, um... It's pretty great. It's pretty great, man. I'm... I love it. Mm -hmm. log, Big fan. Brennan. With medication and zero G therapy, patient Harris is showing improvement. But instead of trying to hide it, I just embrace it. However, it is what it is, man. To interfere. Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. All right. Still no nodes. Relocation. No nodes. Hey, folks, thank you for 200 likes on the video today. I appreciate it. Thank you for pressing the like on my video. Let me in. Right. Right. Let it shine. Hell yeah, man. I thought there was one on my left as well. I guess not. All right. So we have two of these uh, marker fragments so far, guys. Two of them. Yeah. Now the door is open. Yeah. Convenient, right? <laughs> Pew! <laughs> pew, pew, pew! <laughs> There's a node. We do this, and then we go over here. We deactivate this, open the door. We take the shock pad. Very good. Daniel isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? I found a shock pad I can use on the barricade. Man. I'm back there now. Oh, that was an item. On that pad. I'm not losing anyone else. I saw that glow. I saw that glowy glow that looked all glowy. This is just hilarious. It was a glowy glow that glowed glowy. Yes. Your name is Josh too? What up, man? Do you have a glorious beard is the question. You be the judge of that. Exclamation mark Instagram. So you got a walkthroughs, dude? Yeah, I've got two walkthroughs of this game already. One on hard difficulty, one on impossible. All right, the first shot didn't actually register on it because he was still in, like, the animation of spawning. Interesting. Remember, when you reach the morgue, find Captain Mathias' body, get his rig codes, and the it's computer's time. Oh, security, oh, security clearance one. It's okay. We'll have it in a few minutes. Lupa 
and transmit all personnel. This is senior medical officer. Medical is overwhelmed. We need not a whole lot of items in this room, is there? We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us. All right, well. First thing we do is open up the shower. There's actually a secret room back here. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Okay. And now we it's turn this off. We rip the battery out. Set the battery down because this guy's in the way. Right. Your English is so good. Where are you from? I uh, I grew up in the U.S. I grew up in New York. Are Phantom Necromorphs in New Game Plus? Yes. I don't think I've seen one as of yet. I've not seen anything new so far, but apparently they are in New Game Plus. Yes. Anything back here? Doesn't look like it. All right. Hey, Gerald. How have you been, man? That's an elite. It's dead. You know they're an elite if their eyes are glowing red and they have the, uh, the very dark, decayed skin. That's how you know that they are the strong boys. The strong necromorph. But it's fine because we have finger guns. Security request retrieved. He left me. I work in the dark with them scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. You will help me in with them. Did I kill you too fast? <laughs> I killed it so fast it never even died. Look at this. Me and my friend. What should we name him? Oh, you know what? Frankie. Frankie is a great name for this guy. Everyone, meet Frankie. Frankie's got four hands. Well, I say uh, he's he's got three hands. He used to have four, though. Nice profile. Nice profile. Nice armpit, buddy. Nice armpits. If only I could put my arm around him, you know what I mean? Oh, if only there was like some type of like emote I could do to make it so I could like have my arm around him. You know? Me and Frankie hanging out. He won't let me pick him up. <laughs> All right. Stop it. Let's 
stop. That's my good, that's my good pal Frankie. Redneck, maybe the five dollars. Frankie's got four hands is a phenomenal band name. You know what? You might be onto something there. You might be onto something. Frankie's got four hands. The band. I like it. They were the five as well. They were the, the generosity. I appreciate it, man. Was that a glitch? Yeah, I killed the necromorph so quickly that it bugged out. Yeah. Does it have photo mode? No, but this game... Uh, man, I really wish they included a photo mode. That would have been nice. A photo mode for this would have been absolutely glorious. My God, Redneck Ninja with the five gifted members to the community as well. Let's see those cult emotes out there for all the new non-cult members. And of course, Redneck gifting the five members. Thank you very much for that, man. I really appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much for the kindness. Truly can't thank you enough. Thank you. Thanks, Alex. Man, this suit's so dope. R slash pet the damn dog. <laughs> oh, Jesus, dude. Isaac, what's your status? Do you Ew. have the captain's rig? Fuck me. Ugh. Transmitting codes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Jim. God. Maybe this man computer has something. Where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. Right. Um. Was there not something clearance one back here? Or was it clearance two? Oh, you know, we have to go back up the elevator for it. So I'm just going to not care right now. Clearance confirmed. Confirmed. Anyway, how's your day, chat? A little bit of a bumpy ride there. 
Oh, I just realized it has the USM Valor thing on the front of the suit. What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. All right, let's carry on, shall we? We need... Oh, this is what I, th I was thinking of, I think. Clearance confirmed. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Hey, Christina, thank you for joining me again today. All right, let's see what we can sell here. We got this. We have some line gun racks. Let's sell those. Some pulse gun rounds. I got a sneeze. Wait for it. Never mind, it's gone. Never mind. Everyone say hi to wife. Wife is home. Hi, wife. Uh, let's see. Um, let's go ahead and buy a couple power nodes. No, wife, come back. Whoa, what? That's the level six suit that you get after you beat the game. And then, uh... That is insane. And then that's the hand cannon. That's in it. Now I need you to put on this headset. I was going to ask for you. you. <laughs> I had to show wife. <laughs> You go from the badass suit to the foam finger. Yeah, we're out here finger blasting undeads. It's pretty great. All right, carrying on, carrying on. Wants me to go that way. Have we already been through here? There's a bench. Yeah, I mean, let's let's hit it real quick. It's right here. Why not? Why not? Why shouldn't I? Uh, line guns already maxed out for what we have at the moment. So let's go ahead and throw these here, 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 and here. Two more nodes until that is done. We need two more upgrades for the other two uh, branches here. We need, I'm assuming, just two for those two branches there. That's what it looks like to me. Plasma cutter's maxed out, so I don't have to worry about that. We're refining um, the flamethrower relatively soon. Are we going to buy more nodes? I just bought two with the money that I had. You end up getting a lot more money later on in the game, so... We'll be able to buy a lot more at that time. How does the enemy scaling and damage work in New Game Plus? Um, I do believe that the enemies do a little more health and damage in New Game Plus Sark, but I truly am not quite sure as I came in with upgraded weaponry and now I'm using a weapon that just guarantee one shots everything. So, yeah, I'm not able to answer that with accuracy. This is so sick it is. It's pretty cool. Security reporting retrieved. Wish my girlfriend got that excited when I won something in a game. My wife is a gamer as well, so it definitely helps. Either that or she's just really good at, you know, kind of being as excited as I am about things. Either way, I appreciate it. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Entering zero gravity. He was going to say faking it. Yeah, I had to change my phrasing. Maybe my wife's just good at faking it, dude. 
All right. Maybe she's just good at faking it. Just let me live my damn life. All right. <laughs> Anything else over here? Oh, there is. There's actually a lot of stuff over here. Look at this. Look at this. Bang! Let's go up and over to the other side now. I'm gonna leave all these things alone. Don't really need to bother most of this here. What does Bang do? What does Pew do? you do they're identical one's just on left mouse button the other's on space bar Now, the interesting thing about this room is you can't really get the important thing in here until way later in the game. And this box right here is a diamond semiconductor that sells for 25,000 credits. We don't really get that until like chapter nine or 10, I think. It's much later in the game. My CPU be a shotgun. I mean, it's already incredibly overpowered at one shots things. It doesn't really need to do much more than that. A single projectile that one shots literally anything. I mean, you know. Hold on. There's something in that corner over there, isn't there? long as the game and do you recommend it um you can complete the game really quickly if you know it well enough but either way i can recommend this game because it is something that especially if you want to get all the secrets out of the game and all the cool stuff you do have to play through it several times since release i've already got after stream today i'll have 31 hours in the game already so take that you know as you will but it is a quality experience it's a quality graphical experience. The uh, the fights are fun. I love the exploration. You know, it's a pretty linear game, but you still have to like really understand how the like how to path to all the secret stuff. That alone makes it pretty damn cool to me. It's a very faithful remake that improved upon the things that needed to be improved upon. It balanced the things that needed rebalancing. It's just very well done through and through. Oh, this is a rig. Oh, there's Valker's rig. Hey, well, we got that out of the way. Hey, go away. You too. And it left what was good, good. Yeah, exactly. They were very faithful, but they, you know, changed things up that needed to be changed up for the benefit of it. I'll put it like this. This remake is so good that after you play it, I can almost guarantee that you'll never even look at the original game ever again. It's that good. This is how a remake should be done. I missed. The 
the only reason you'll ever look at the original is probably just strictly for a graphical comparison because it is pretty uh pretty significant the graphical difference Clearance one. Nice, no coda. Very nice. I'm working on the secret ending now. Honestly, that's why I'm glad I played the original first. Yeah, dude, it's like an experience. Like, just experiencing the remake after playing the uh, the original you're just able to see the differences and you're able to do a direct comparison and just appreciate the hell out of it right such a cool thing remake has been almost universal in its praise yeah I generally think it'll be game of the year contender it has high potential i don't think it'll get game of the year though based on one game and one game alone Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom, also known as Breath of the Wild 2, is coming out uh, late spring, early summer, I believe. And while I would love to say this game is going to get it, when a game like that exists, even if it's not like as good as Breath of the Wild to many, I feel like just because it's Legend of Zelda, by name alone, it's going to win. That's That's pretty much all most people need. When it comes down to it, screwed. Primaries laboring, we're hemorrhaging fuel. Fuck if I know why. I'm taking Danvers to the fuel depot to fix it. Gotta keep the team focused or we'll crack. Temple out. Can they give remakes game of the year? I believe so. Will you be playing Legend of Zelda? Yes. Offline. We're tethered to a four trillion ton payload. Without the engines, it's dragging us down to the planet. Can you handle it alone? If you've already completed the game so thoroughly, Nokota, I would say you should invest that money into something else. Unless you really want to support Motive specifically as a studio, then of course, if you enjoyed it to that level and you want to support them more, then sure. But as a consumer, I would say you've already given them, you know, the, the you know, the flat a flat license fee, right? I would say you're better off investing your money into something else at that point. It's not that you're snubbing them by any means. It's just a little bit extra on top of what they've already gotten from you, you know? <laughs> What's up, dinner? All right, here's our ripper. Believe it or not, this one was alive. Believe it or not. All right, pulse rifle upgrade. Very good. Very good. All right, we need the master override for that. I do believe all of these are going to have specifically weapon upgrades inside of them. 
So I need to make sure that when I get the master override, I come back and uh, look for all that stuff. Autopsy report, Doctor. We're not allowed to finish this playthrough until we have all those upgrades. The subject was dismembered Them's the rules. That was Carl? Yeah, well, you know, it is what it is. You win some, you lose some. Today, Carl is a loser. Evacuate this area immediately. Oh, so you mean go in? Okay, cool. Here we go. <laughs> okay, that one, that one you can't kill. Fuel preserves de offline. reserves depleted. Don't worry about it, man. I got you. I got you. Refueling sequence activated. Additional fuel required for engine restart. Bang, bang, bang. Hey, Josh, what's going on, man? Swap Neil, hello. Bang, bang. It's going well, Swap. How are you, dude? Now, we can't go in there until later. We can go in here and uh, figure this situation out, though. Okay, now that we dealt with that, let's go back. <laughs> I hope you're doing well today, Vern. Oh, you're already dead. All right, I think we got everything here. Bring it back in here. Hope you're doing well, Josh. I will say that the um, the hand cannon makes this uh, this difficulty not matter whatsoever. Should I get a switch just so I can play Breath of the Wild? That's what I did, and I found it completely worth it. I still use the switch for other things too. Sometimes I'll play Dark Souls in bed. Uh, I'm also a big fan of Dead Cells. And there's a few other games I've played, uh, you know, over the last couple years as well that I've really enjoyed my time with. Items, baby. All right. Um, we need to. Oh, is there nothing I can do from here? I thought there was something I could do through this. I guess not. Oh, right. It's the access fuel station key card. Right. Right. Do you have aim assist on? You don't seem to miss? No, I'm playing with keyboard and mouse. I don't have aim assist. I used to play some shooters competitively, so I just... I'm quick to aim. Uh, circuit breaker, lights and life support. Well, I guess the lights go out so we can turn on the south refuel station. Baby, when the lights go out.
I'll show you what it's all about. Definitely hear one crawling around somewhere. Oh, there you are. Okay, I've got a fuel Only a oh, look at these guys. I still need to get the center Why are they so red? Someone really screwed with these fuel lines. Are these? Are these the new ones? They're very red. I sh maybe I shouldn't have killed them so quickly so I can see what they can do. I don't. I've never seen them so red. They've got to be the new ones, right? Or maybe they're just elites. I don't know. Are those the new phantoms? Are they? Okay, next time I see one, I'm going to let it live for a moment and see what it's capable of doing. I killed them way too quickly. My bad. Oh, there's our first encounter with the new necromorphs. What's up, guitar player? Basically, reskin models, but they look mean as hell. They do, yeah. I was concerned about them. Are you on Twitch as well? No. I used to stream on Twitch. I no longer do. I streamed on Twitch for almost six years, and then I moved here about... Uh, let's see. Not at the end of this month, but the end of next month will be a year. What was it? The 24th or 25th of March? So it's been a slight bit over 10 months now. Let's see what we got around here. Ah, Ricochet Tracer. That's for 11,000. You don't say. All right, we got the Ricochet Tracer. Very nice. Okie dokie. We continue on. We must go. My people need me. I had to respond to a comment. You guys know there's still people that go to my God of War videos and accuse me of playing on easy difficulty? Do you know how good that makes me feel? To play on the hardest difficulty of a game and get accused of playing on the easiest difficulty? Listen, man, I'm not much of an egotistical person, but that shit makes me feel good. Or when they accuse me of cheating in Elden Ring and stuff like that. Oh my god. Listen, man. That makes me feel like a damn boss. Alright. 
You don't understand. Clearance confirmed. Confirmed. Oh, well, that's just because you're cheating? True. <laughs> True. I got nothing better to do, man. May as well cheat in video games. <laughs> you know how it is, right? Hey, Lorenzo, what's up, man? Ah! Look at that, guys. I finally took damage. Filthy cheater. All right, you guys remember the tactic for this room, right? When you come into this room the, uh, to, uh, you know, get cleansed, when you see this here, the decon chamber, you want to go to the back left of the room where you see the vent on the wall. A lot of people struggle with this room specifically because it's a little bit tighter corridors. But if you stand here next to the vent on the wall, the enemies will often come out of the other three vents on the ceiling first, which allows you to just kill them off one at a time. Next should be on the left here. There it goes. And then after you kill the second enemy on the left, you'll see the third one pop over here. So you want to move to your left, take out the enemy that spawns out, out of this vent first, and then immediately turn to your right. And you'll see that guy pop out. And then the room is clear. Good job. You did it. If you do what I did right there, even on, uh, even if you don't have the finger gun here, the hand cannon, you can take out the enemies relatively quickly early on in the game, even on impossible difficulty, and you'll be able to basically not take any damage if you do it like that. What's up, Barn Door? How you doing? I've seen a few people die in that room, so that's why I figured I would offer my uh, my own little tactic for it. Hey, Dovanus, thank you for the pound 79. Didn't know this had New Game Plus. I'm surprised. Yeah, man. It's a good time, too. It's a good time. You get the hand cannon from completing impossible? Yes. If you beat the game on impossible mode without dying, you get this and the burnished suit. Uh-oh. Frozen. Thank you for the $2. Hey, Josh. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Ah, oh, damn, dude. Oh, damn. Hey, Cruzen, thank you for the two. Dovanus, thank you for the pound 79. I appreciate you both. Thank you, guys. Just got the Valor suit. Nice. Very nice. I was really hoping I hit him mid-flight. I did not. I missed. Do I hear something flying around? I do. Where are you? That was the wrong button. Let me kill you and then stasis you. It's fun. All right. Now we need to make sure we grab all the items in the room because as soon as we start this up, this is going to open up and all the, all the items are going to get vacuumed out. They're all going to get spaced. Let's make sure we grab all the items beforehand. Pretty sure we got most of them, if not all at this point. Hmm. 
Yeah, I think we're okay. Let's just continue on. Whoosh. What's your favorite TV show? Um. Centrifuge activated. I don't really know. I guess if I'm, uh, I'm going to separate this by, by animated and then non-animated. Animated is definitely Futurama and it's not even close. And then for non-animated or live action, I would probably say The Expanse. And can still one shot? It is. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left is restarting the engines, right? Ready when you are. Oh no! Well, impossible difficulties over, chat. <laughs> I looked away for half a second. You can now choose to continue at hard difficulty or go back to the main menu. All right, to hard difficulty it is. Good thing we already completed it on impossible, right? I thought I had a couple more seconds of time there. Wait, what happened? Bro, what? Wait. I never saved, chat. <laughs> I never saved, dude. Shit, man. All right, speed run strats. How far are we back? We're back at the beginning of the game. Oh, that's funny. We lost about uh, an hour and a half. Whoops. Whoops. It's, a, it's on hard difficulty now because I died there. I deserved it. I got cocky. The game put me in my place. Why not just like restart it impossible at this point? Because I'm using the finger gun, which means that it's not going to matter. Everything's getting one shot anyway. It simply does not matter. I've watched the first three episodes, Martin. Yeah, I think it's great. Really well done. Do you have it now, though? No, it's on hard. Because I died. If you die, it reverts. Hey, Miss Bradica. Security request retrieved. It's died. We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. Yeah, when I get to a store, I'll be able to get the items back. Yeah. What's up, oh Spring? God, Isaac, Welcome back. You made it. Just they're everywhere. Shit, is he? Uh... He's gone. Nothing I can do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw. Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew. What Unfortunate the the crew? moments. Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of... It's been all right, Spring. How are you? And you're both I thought since you started at the beginning so anyway, we will not begin again on Possible. Because everything's getting one shot and it doesn't matter. The difficulty itself does not matter when the hand cannon exists. There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system. No matter the difficulty, they're all getting one shot. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of a quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon.
Go, go, go. Alright. Yeah, even impossible mode is easy with this. Yep, exactly. Hey, Batuhan, thank you for the 249 euros. I hope I pronounced your name properly. It says, nice stream, drink a coffee for me. Hey, thank you very much. Will do. Thank you for the kindness. I truly appreciate it. I hope you're doing well, Miss Pratica. Thank you for your first ever super chat here, man. Very kind. How's Tarkov been? I've not played for a couple days now, but, uh, you know, it's been a good time. I'll probably play again, um, maybe tonight if my friend's around. If not, then I'll probably play on Sunday, uh, because I'll likely have Sunday off of stream. What do you think of Demon Souls? Great game. Man, what a big reset. Those arms, legs. Does that even kill them? Or do they just stop moving? Hey, thank you, Kai. Auto loader malfunction. Stand by. Ah, oh, that's an elite right there. To kind of give you a picture of how damn powerful the elites are and how many shots they take to kill. <laughs> versus the hand cannon that one taps them very good hey what's up paul 476 people watching but only 278 likes like the stream people hey you said it man you said it if you haven't left a like on the video yet guys make sure you do it helps out in a big way i appreciate you being here do you recommend playing the original Dead Space before if I haven't played it before? Um, honestly, um, I would say just go for the remake if you haven't played the original Dead Space. Mostly because you just kind of save that little bit of extra money if you, uh, if you don't already own it. If you do own it, I would probably say yes because the original does play well enough to where you can justify doing so. I would just say keep it pretty casual and then if you want to up the difficulty uh, you know on the remake do it then play on a lower difficulty on the original just so you can get through it experience the graphics experience you know the gameplay see what it has to offer you and then go to the remake but if you don't own it already then i would say just go straight for the remake I thought so. And yeah, they give it 300 likes on the video, guys. All right, here's Jim.
What's up, Risky? Hey, Hoogle. Yeah, Jim was taking a big nap. Big nap time hours. This guy behind me is so slow. I wouldn't doubt if he went through a vent again instead of chasing me. Yep, there he is. <laughs> he went through a vent. <laughs> Feel like this game can get addictive? Um, I, I don't know about addictive per se. But it's definitely good and you can enjoy your time playing it. goes back to the entrance we can go that path a little bit later for now we go this way so that way we can go upstairs and activate the battery thing oh richard i straight up missed this i'm sorry man thank you for the five dollar super chat thank you dude if i for, for whatever reason i don't see a super chat don't be afraid to say hey i you missed a super chat or something okay Seriously, I did not intend to miss that. I'm sorry. I feel bad when I do that. How do you stay motivated to better yourself with something you're already so good at? I get bored of games far before I get half as good as you. Um, I don't know, man. Uh, I guess it's just the nature of the the nature of the world of content creation. You just if you enjoy making content enough to where you want to keep it going then you just kind of you just kind of do it you know like you just you just kind of fall into the habit of trying to improve even when it comes to single player games it definitely helps that it's something that i do full time right like i invest a lot of my time into this and because i invest so much of my time into this i want to make sure that i'm able to do things at a quality level that people can enjoy right so i think that's a large factor i would probably say that that would be a good like 80 to 85 percent of the factor of what i have going on But also a big part of it for me as well is before I started streaming, I um I was big on achievement hunting. That was a that was a thing that I did before I got into streaming. Ow. So there there came a certain point when it come when it came to achievement hunting that you had to be able to apply a certain level of skill to get certain achievements. There's plenty of achievements out there where you don't have to worry about skill at all. You just casually play through a game and you get rewarded for it, right? Like, that's just the nature of it. But there are some where you actually have to be good at something. And so I would, I would have to practice. And so I, I would spend, you know, time practicing to make sure that I could do things to get these achievements that I was going for to get them on my account. And so I, I just am used to the idea largely because of that. Where are you? There you are. Not gonna lie, didn't hear you there, buddy. Didn't hear or see you. Hear no evil, see no evil. All right, we should be done here. Have any goals as a content creator, or do you just do it for fun and enjoyment? Um, so I started off for fun and enjoyment, and then it became a uh, a full time gig. It's something that 
it just came to a point where I was able to start doing it full time. And so I jumped in. And so a, a major philosophy of mine after a lot of, you know, a lot of years is to make sure that it's still fun and enjoyable for me as well. But I still have goals. My goal, my biggest goal this year is to get my videos to do as well as my live streams do. And so that's what I've been working on. I've been putting out a lot of videos on my channel and trying to up the viewership on them. My live streams will go anywhere from like 5,000 to 20,000 total views every single day. And I want to get my videos to do that as well. So that's my big goal right now. Have you played Ghost of Tsushima? A little bit. I've never done a full playthrough of it, but that is something that I will be making videos on at some point this year. We're on board. Something hit the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown's lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kelly. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What? Protocol Back to the Kelly in gamers. Else. We stick to procedure. Did I used to have long hair? Yes. When I was in uh, high school, I had hair that went out halfway down my back. You only play RPGs? I play a big variety of games. Everything from first person shooters to RPGs, action adventures, um, strategy, both, you know, real time and tactical. I play a pretty wide variety of games. Oh, the sound design is so good. thing was still making gargling noises after the stasis ended. Hi, yes, hello. I feel like we're making pretty good time. Overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac. We need the Killian fixed now. Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there.
Right. Oops, there goes the Kellyan. Uh oh. <laughs> Just die, man. Isaac, what's happening down there? Johnson's gone. Kelly and two. A singularity core overloaded. No! Kelly was our only way home. We're trapped. No. I'm not losing two good people for nothing. We're trapped, man! What about the command computer? It's a prick. All the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Okay. Track the rig. Okay, here. Captain Gotta be careful, guys. Advice. Chen's gonna drop it and say okay, hello. I need you to run. Status deceased? Even the captain? God. Lost a lot of progress from that death? Yeah. Closer to medical. You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body. That's all right. I've had worse. Codes, we... What was that? Chen? Okay, Hammond, run! Was your time for the impossible run? Uh, eight and a half hours. Like eight hours, 36 minutes, if I remember right, right, dog? When does the foam finger come into play? Right after this little sequence here where we can get to the first store. Right here. Gotta sell all these goods, man. You know what the fastest time completed was? No idea. throw on the burnished suit for a while change it up a little bit this suit's pretty damn cool too yeah it's pretty solid as well Good shit, man. Oh, shoot. I forgot that we have the line gun upgrade there, too. Uh, you know what? It's fine. Won't be needing those anyway. we do this and then we go foam finger equip there very nice the only gun we're ever gonna need baby let's continue on shall we all right we got wow a lot of nodes there it's fine 30 nodes very good Plasma cutter's already maxed, so line gun. Let's 
so many nodes. Isn't the foam finger the big hand that people wave at sports games? Yes. It's also the hand cannon in this game. And it kills enemies real quick. Let's make a save here. Okay, you guys saw that clearance level one room, so I was right in remembering that there was something back this way. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, this time I'm going to run back and grab it. I'll come back up the elevator to grab that instead of moving forward. Just, just in case there happens to be another marker fragment in there. I don't know if there is or not, but I just want to be certain. Is there anything over on this side? Norp. No, there is not. Don't let them out. Don't let them out. Give me the pulse rifle. an actual foam finger yes yes indeed access to the morgue the morgue yeah but the barricade was put together in a hurry a hydrazine tank might blow it open just need a detonator like maybe a shock pad all right it's time to end the call oh, hammond come on isaac i got stuff to do the one who attacked us i swear to god it was chen but i saw him die if they barricaded the morgue maybe it was to keep something in yeah yeah Hammond yeah dude way to do the math on that one buddy good job Mr. Hammond the private investigator That's not a battery. Okay. Give me that. Hello. Level two security clearance required. Oh, I'm not good enough. I'm not patient good enough for that retrieve. one. I hear the tests on patient Harris were inconclusive. Given the reports from the colony, he's lucky to have his faculties at all. Well, a divine experience would leave an impression on anyone's life. Perhaps. But I found nothing divine in all that. Blood. Walk this on over here. There we go. I'm positive. And with Captain Matthias flying and physically. This fellow may be our best chance. Harris is Dr. Brennan's patient. And your methods Look, Mercer. Things are complicated enough already. I can't sign off on this. Level 
We don't have clearance for those either. How long can you put to wait? The way I said that reminded me of Welcome to the Circus of Value. It is a one shot kill. Yes. And that's why I said the difficulty truly does not matter because everything it dies in one shot, even when they have the most possible health. Entering vacuum. Hmm. A little cold in outer space, guys. It's a little cold out there. It lacks heat. Bioshock is such a good game. Needs a remake as well. I would love to see a Bioshock 1 remake. Oh my god. Imagine the increased graphical fidelity. Oh my god. Yeah, this moment here is pretty damn cool. Indeed, Miss Pratica. There's our hydrazine. What's happening there? Did you find the coal? No sign of her yet. But I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I just need to find a shock pad. Okay. Work fast, Isaac. Entering zero gravity. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Okay, we go this way. What the hell? It shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. My friend, that would be something called a Leviathan. Very good. Can I have that? Thank you. All right, clearance one on that door there. Hey, stop it. God. Took one step out of the captain's desk to Chen. That thing. He almost got me. You okay? Schematics. I tried to escape pod. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. <laughs> Hurry, Isaac. I'm scared, Isaac. Well, it wants me to go that way, so clearly we're not going that way right away. All right, we've already been here. Never mind. Never mind. Let's continue on. Yo, Redneck Ninja, thank you for the five bucks, dude. Isaac is only being in the universe that understands what happens when you try finger butt hole. True. That's true, man. Um, turns out nothing can withstand it. True story. So all those players in uh, Elden Ring, they were really onto something, man. They were truly onto something. Thanks for the five bones, dude. Oh no, we're being ambushed. Whatever shall I do? Where's the one on the right? There's supposed to be one on the right. Oh, I think I hear it in the vents. He's a little he's a little behind schedule today, I guess. Uh, 
Alright, there he goes. Now we go downstairs, and there's gonna be like five or six more down here. Starting on the left. Life, Josh, you play too much Dead Space. Surgical log. Dr. How do you get the hand cannon? By beating the game on impossible difficulty without dying. Too much talking from everyone at all angles. Everyone, shut the hell up. Thank you. Thank you. Let's not forget this room. There's a marker fragment in here. Thank you again for the five bones, Redneck. Stan, man, thank you for the 449 to a good weekend, Josh. Hey, thanks, man. Hope you have a great weekend as well. Thank you very much for spreading the generosity here. Thank you, man. Thank you very much, Stan. I'm doing all right, man. Edwin, how are you? <laughs> yeah, Terry. Yeah, dude. I know that feel. But hey, at least you're on the other side of the, the big part of it, right? That's cool. All right, these are all upgraded already, so we'll just throw these into this. No adjacent node detected. Right. Okay, that's done. Thank you again, Stan and Redneck. I appreciate you, fellas. I don't like how the suits are just reskins of level three suit and not the other levels. Yeah, I mean, I guess. Yeah, I get that. I just kind of take it in for what it is, and I just like being able to change up my look every so often, you know? Carrying on. Carrying on. Ah, yes, this guy. My man got the shock of a lifetime. <laughs> uh, streamer's funny. You're all laughing. Good job, everyone. Good job. Good job for laughing. Watch the voltage on that pad. I'm not losing anyone else. Hey, Corin, what's up? Love the foam finger? Heck yeah, dude. Rando, what's up, man? Point and say bang, yes. How's Isaac so good at combat? Just an engineer? It's like he's stuck in a time loop and he keeps repeating the same aspects of the game over and over, you know? 
You know what I mean? It's wild out here. I didn't want to exit out of that. How to get rid of motion sickness caused by playing these sorts of games? Hmm, that's, that's a tough one, man. That is a tough one. I would say, um, if you can narrow down what exactly causes the motion sickness, then that could help you out. Maybe turn off motion blur. Motion blur exists to simulate what can happen when you see something moving quickly. And so it, it can feel very unnatural in games. Also, if a game offers the option to widen the field of view, try to do that as well. Uh, try to aim for like a basic 90 to 95 field of view for most games, specifically horizontal, and that will help you out as well. A lot of people will notice that they get more motion sickness when they go for a lower field of view, when they when they go anywhere between like, uh, I don't know, 60 to 80, or if you even go lower than that horizontal, it can, it can cause some pretty big motion sickness issues. And if you go above 95, you start to get what's called the fisheye effect, which is, which can cause motion sickness as well, because it's not how the human eye naturally perceives things. So I would say try to change the field of view if possible. And that can help you out in a big way as well. I don't know if field of view is an option in this game. In fact, I'll look. See, motion blur, you can turn all the way off. I left it at 10 because 10 felt comfortable for me. But I don't think... I don't think field of view is an option in this game. No. You'll see that field of view is often not an option with a lot of uh, horror games specifically because they want you to feel claustrophobic. That's part of the experience of, uh, of a game like this. But if it does give you that option, try to put it around 90 or 95 and see if that helps you out. Find Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig code and the computer's all ours. Hey, Syme, thank you for the 50 Turkish. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you very much for the kindness. It's very kind of you. Thank you so much. I hope that helps, Gray Matter. Also, if you can turn off any head bobbing effects, that can help you out as well. That's something to consider, too. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions with that unitologist in the hearing. Now, it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human hey Graham hope you're doing well too man Limbs missing good to see you so intact okay Time for real autopsy. Level 2 security clearance required. Level 2 security security clearance required. That's an elite, man. You tried. Gold star for you. It wants me to go that way. That this is the long the gun where Wow, the words. This is the room where you originally get the line gun. I've already got it, so I don't need to worry about it, but uh we're just gonna open up that door later on when it's time. Nothing down here? Okay. You and super, me and the wife bought a house? Damn man, that's awesome. Congrats. That's big. It's bath time. All right, wants me to go in there. We're going to go down here and grab these items first. There's a power node down here with my name on it. Okay. 
This is the one that glitched out earlier on us, but, uh, you know, we're good now. Quiet time. Still in Tennessee? Right on, man. Very cool. You're not very nice, lady. Alright, I should probably make a save. It's been a bit. Let's do the save. Mm, chapter 1 New Arrivals. Hard, hard. Um. Oh yeah, that was our. These are our two previous completed playthroughs. Okay, just making sure I'm not overwriting those ones. Remastered worth it? I've missed good horror games. Uh, Harry, this is not a remaster. It is indeed a remake. It's much more than a remaster. In this remake specifically, they not only built the game from the ground up. Sorry, I know it's loud. Not only did they rebuild the game from the ground up, but they also improved and rebalanced a lot of aspects in the game that a lot of people struggled with in the first game. For example, uh, the flamethrower is actually good in this game now. The next thing is they've actually made it so some like some of the fights, like the ADS cannon against the uh, the asteroids, as well as the fights against the Leviathan, are much much better experiences. It's a massively improved experience. So if you're into good horror stuff, this is a great game for that because it's a much better quality experience and everything else that they didn't rebalance or feel need that they needed to fix is actually very faithful to the original. I've been able to burn through the game because I remember playing it, you know, so much back when it first came out that I remember a lot of the game I was able to get through it very quickly because of that. So if you're looking for a good quality horror game experience, this is the game for it right now. Yes. Is the story still the same as the original? Yes. Check phone. Uh, yeah, wife, that's fine. played this is this xbox exclusive it's on uh playstation xbox and pc weird it went for that one over there this time instead of the body over here so it very much so is random interesting What's the deal with the weapon you have? If you complete the game on the hardest difficulty without dying, you get a special weapon called the hand cannon. It's a foam finger. It's a bit of a bit of a meme. It's like a joke. This is not a gun that you get by default. You have to beat it on impossible difficulty without dying. Oh. I seem to have brought a leg with me. What's up, Andrew? It looks modded. Yeah, it's very out of place, but it is built into the game itself. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Uh, do I have the clearance for these, or are they clearance Unless... two? I think they're two. Yeah. Oh, this one's one. There's a shortcut to engineering. Yeah, wife, I agree. It's like a throwback to older video game mechanics where you, you get rewarded for completing the game in a certain way. Hope you're doing well, Andrew. It's good to see you today. Happy Friday, dude. Someone's putting their foot down. All right. All right, buddy.
Yeah, that's enough for three big nodes. Um. Hmm. Please remove yourself from my path. Thank you. Is it open world? No. think let me think this is the room where we got this yeah i want to go back this way because there's a clearance one room up this elevator right here or not this elevator up this path words Not a bad little room this early on in the game, to be honest. Not a bad little room. Have to earn to cheat is the best way to go. Yeah, go like Goldeneye. Yeah, dude. Yeah, it's it's fun. It's a fun game mechanic when it's built into it like that, you know? Stuff like this by itself can add a lot of replay value. Why does it tell me to go this way? When it wants me to go here. Oh, it's just a hangar bay, and you can just follow that path back to it, I guess. Okay. It's a better Twitch TV emote, wife. All right. We're almost at the point in which we uh, we died earlier. So that's cool. Next door, we're going to change our suit up as well. We're going to do the uh, level six suit. Dude, uh, that deal. I actually do remember that. I do. I was really excited about it. It actually played pretty well for me too back then. That was quite the surprise for me. Isaac, this damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Unlimited ammo? Yeah. This is uh, not a main weapon. Like, uh, it's not a main game weapon. This is a weapon that you get rewarded for completing the game on the hardest difficulty without dying. And that's what we did yesterday. Beat the whole game without a single death. And now we have this and the suit that I'm wearing, which is a special reward for doing so as well. And now we're playing through the game with it because um, there's actually a secret alternate ending that you can get on New Game Plus, which is brand new to the remake. And so we're just kind of going this route to see if we can do that. As from Doug, indeed. Oh, where'd the other item go? Whoops. Well, I think one of the items died. Oh, there it is. Ha. Found it.
I said it yesterday as well, but the music in this area actually reminds me of the music that plays in the underground area in Elden Ring. No play a game? Okay, see you later. How many of those marker fragments have you found so far? Two. Now again, we need clearance three for this one specifically, but that has the, uh, the diamond semiconductor in it, which sells for 25,000 credits. So next time we're in this room, we'll be able to, uh, to grab that. Why does it tell me to press E from all the way back here? Weird. Ever played The Surge? Yes, I actually enjoy those games. I don't think they're like the best Souls likes by any means, but I enjoy them. Specifically The Surge too. And there's 12 markers? Yes. What's your opinion on the game? I think it's awesome. For me, this remake is a 10 out of 10. This is how this is how remakes should be done. All other remakes that come out for other games in the future are going to have to really uh, make sure that they, uh, you know, they have a certain quality limit to them. This is definitely push the bar up. All right, here's Velker's rig. Velker, Volker, I'm not sure which, but I say Velker for now. Uh, Red Dead into that. I liked Red Dead Revolver and Red Dead Redemption 1. I didn't like 2 so much. RDR1 will ever come to PC? Exiting you know, that's a great question. I'm surprised they haven't done that yet, considering it would sell like crazy if they were to do so. Really not sure why that's not a thing already. Just like I don't know why Ghost of Tsushima is not on PC yet, because I know that would sell like crazy too. Like Returnal? Returnal is coming out on the... 15th and you already know Returnal is going to sell like absolute hotcakes tell you man these studios are sitting on just huge piles of money yeah exactly naughty re4 we're talking to you orbital position compromised correct course immediately Where is Elden Ring? On the shelf. Engineering log. Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple reporting. Christ, still can't believe the Chief is gone. It's all fallen apart since the Captain died. Everyone down here is on their last nerve. We thought the rioting was the worst of it. Until those things came through the vents. Their faces. Fuck, those were my lunch buddies. Liz's friends. Old boyfriends. And out of nowhere, the engines are screwed. Primary's laboring, we're hemorrhaging fuel. Fuck if I know why. Um I'm taking Danvers to the fuel depot to fix it. Gotta keep the team focused or it'll crack. Temple out. Hey guys. Where's the other suits? Huh? 
Huh? Maybe if we just unequip this, it'll put it back on. Maybe that's the way of it. Yeah, that's got to be the way of it. It's got to be. Yep, there it is. Perfect. Perfect. If the returnal sales don't match hotcake sales at McDonald's, you owe all the chat five dollars each. I don't know about all that, bud. I don't know about all that. That's badass. Yeah, this is the uh, level six suit that you can wear in New Game Plus. Got scared, didn't you? It's only a skin. Any news on the engines? Yeah, but it makes no sense. They're out of fuel. The centrifuge is offline. We're tethered to a four trillion ton payload. Without the engines, it's dragging us down to the planet. Can you handle it alone? Sure. Fix the centrifuge, get the fuel running, then do a full restart. But you'll need to stabilize. What's up, John? There. Standing by. Fast as you can, Isaac. <laughs> And the Ripper. I think it's good to remake because it respects base game and improves only just a few features. It's Dead Space except better in almost every way. Exactly. There's a few people that are, uh, you know, they're, they're very against the idea of Isaac having a voice in the first game. I was like, you can't expect them to do a remake when <laughs> without a voice when his voice is already in two and three. As well as a lot of people don't like what they did to change Isaac's appearance, but I mean, ultimately, you barely see his face regardless. It's got a helmet on 99.9% .9 of the time, so to me, it's a pretty trivial thing to care about. Autopsy report, Dr. Nicole Brennan. Rig identifies the subject with junior engineer. <laughs> We carry on, gamers. We carry on. Does it want me to go that way? It does. We did check out the bathroom. We did. <laughs> Clearance too. Yeah, Strong Bear. If you want to check out Elden Ring content, I've got 26 playlists of Elden Ring stuff on my channel already. Definitely go check some of that out, as mentioned. Those exist specifically for people to watch if that's what they want to watch. like the Isaac's Dead Space 2 face, but it makes sense to make the character look similar to the actor. I mean, dude, his face could literally be something that we would never see and it wouldn't change anything for me. You can make, you could literally make his face look like a steaming pile of shit and it would make a difference to me. <laughs> it's not going to physically change the way the game is played at all. That's, that's what I'm getting at. That's my point. His appearance truly does not matter. You hardly see it whatsoever. Yeah, 
and make him look like Walmart Bill Clinton from Elden Ring. Exactly. Did I pull that down? I think I did. Yes. Going so quickly, man. watching nobody saves the world and i'm loving it so fun dude that game is something else i never actually finished it but that game was a great time ow must be the meta gun <laughs> the meta cannon you got touched i know crazy right We gotta restore power. Power. Isaac. Damn it. Daniels? You made it. Thank God. After the bridge, we saw it. I'm glad to disappoint. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them then. I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I tracked down your rig. You're an engineer, right? I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help. Ooh, and now it's all dark and spooky in here, man. Someone hold me. All right. Right. Uh, I need to see what these do. I'm gonna kill one of them. Okay. I've got a few Let's see what they do. Full, is it the same thing as the uh, the other things? It is. So these are the uh, the new necromorphs that you see in New Game Plus. It looks like they have like two babies' heads and a total of five eyes there. Interesting. Pretty much just a reskin of the uh, the baby ones there, but. Still kind of cool. Necromorph will gladly hold you. <laughs> Pew bang, pew bang, pew bang. Pew bang. Hey, Kratoga, happy Friday to you as well, man. I almost missed.
and do the achievement of ripping off a live part i do need to do that still yeah i do indeed need to do that still i should be able to do that at some point uh maybe maybe we go for that yeah let, let's try to get that let me go ahead and equip this here we'll use this for a little while and see if we can actually rip a part off of an enemy Hey. That space is your new Elden Ring? Nah, I won't play it nearly as much. Nah. All right, not a lot going on in here. Quite busy at work, but you know, it's never, never time for some job. I love it, dude. Good to have you back, Kratoga. I do understand the work grinds. Yeah, never, never too late for some Josh feed. I feel you, man. I appreciate you tuning in. All right, that's full up. Are we full up on the line gun right now, too? We are. Guess we'll just throw these in the ripper for now. All right, let me talk about the strategy for this room. We're going to go ahead and use the finger gun here. Actually, you know what? No, just to show what we can do in this room. What you want to do when you walk into this room, this is the decon chamber. You just walk in. You start the sequence and then you walk to the back left side in front of the opposing door and then you're going to see an enemy here and then here and then there you worry about this vent on the wall last if you stand here no enemies will pop out of it until the fourth enemy jumps in so you wait for this guy to hop out here first hard to see him in the fog oh he's over there Okay, he's down. He's down. That's how you make the room easy. You basically just want to stand next to this vent right here so that way it pops out last. Gives yourself that clearance. If you stand underneath the vents on the other side, like underneath the ceiling, they'll uh they'll fall down right on top of you. Okay, now we need to try to rip a limb off of one of these things. The whole idea is to weaken the limbs and then rip it off with kinesis. Not sure if that's going to work out so well, but we're going to try. I think uh, the plasma cutter might actually do a little bit too much damage. Uh, basically, two shots will sever any limb, it seems, right now. Here we are here. 
That's good. Uh, when, you're, when you're trying to get an achievement for ripping off damaged limbs, it's not so good. Don't get me wrong. Higher damage is generally good, but when you're trying to do a specific thing, it makes it more difficult. Hey, Gara, what's up? Boy. I have the hardest time seeing these guys. How dare you? How dare you? Yeah, that's my plan, Hammer Man. I'm gonna use a different weapon to try to weaken the weaken a limb. I'm gonna give it a few more goes with the plasma cutter first. If it doesn't work out, then we try something like the pulse rifle or whatever. Just because the pulse rifle does much lower damage per round in general. That was my thought too. Love you can see the planet down there. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left is restarting the engines, right? Ready when you are. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm not confident in that run. I'm not. Now we go. We're good. Oh, you died? Shit. All right. Didn't realize I died there. My mistake. Okay. Uh, sir, can you just chill there for a moment? All right. Apparently I did a clean chop of that. I thought I just ripped it off. It didn't look like I actually cut it off, but apparently I did. All right. All right. We've officially passed up the point in which we were at earlier. Very, very good. All right, maybe I should foam finger this one. <laughs> it, it one shot that too. Oh no. Ah, oh, easy. Okay, cool. <laughs> oh shit, man. Hey, Carson. Please hold, friend. Please hold right there.
Ah, oh, damn it. This thing's nuts. 160 rounds in the magazine? What the shit, man? Redneck, have a good night, man. I'll see you later. Thanks for chilling today. Thanks for leaving a like on the video and all that as well, guys. I appreciate it. It's very kind. I'm all out of stasis juice. Got it. Isaac, fuel storage is unlocked. It'll give you access to the engine chamber. Have you watched Rick and Morty? Yeah. Oh, damn, I did too much damage. All right. Unfortunate. Even the pulse rifle does pretty decent damage right now. What's up, Dopamine? How's it going? I think you're playing these games because I'm too scared, but I love the story. Hey, Bat2, thanks for joining me for it. all slimy in here. Hey Fred, what's up? Nice guy, Fred. Nice guy. Clearance three room here. I forgot all about that. Engineering loss. Yep. Look at that schematic. You scared the hell out of me. I forgot you were there. Oh. <laughs> hey, bud. I remembered you. Foam finger a mod? No, you unlock it by beating the whole game on the hardest difficulty without dying.
But yeah, you beat the you beat impossible difficulty without dying and you get rewarded this weapon. All right, nothing back there. Hello, friend. All right, you are going to get uh, this treatment. I'm so sorry. Is your arm still there? Okay, this thing is killing arms like crazy too. Okay. I got it. I got to do it one bullet at a time. Correct course immediately. This goes all the way back up here. We just do that. More of a fun gun to play around with. Yeah. Okie dokie. Well, that's all done. There's going to be some more enemies that pop up in this room, but we can deal with that when the time comes. For now, we just need to throw this in this room. And then make sure we have all the loot. We check down here before we go upstairs. There we go. Make sure we have all the loot here. All right, very good. Let's plug in this battery. Gonna make a whole bunch of other enemies spawn, but that's okay. Warning, engine power failure. Replace power cell to begin ignition sequence. Okay, now what we're going to do is I'm going to kill every enemy in the room except for one. And I'm going to try to rip off one of their limbs. Are you the last one? You might be. See, what, what the hell is even that? It just... Well, the pulse rifle ain't it for that either. Maybe I can try it with the force gun later on because the force gun can like really fray limbs and stuff as well. So maybe I just try that out later. Just gotta wait until we get that uh, specific weapon. Yeah, we could try the Ripper as well. Why not? We do have it. Why not? Isaac, you did it. The Ishimor's moving again. Whoever sabotaged the fucking engines. Then you brought a time to figure it out. 
Autopilot's taking us into geostationary orbit. Wait, you're flying us through the planet crack debris? That's what the asteroid defense system is for. But the ADS is offline. I've got the system readouts here. Hammond, the instruments are Couple of bad strikes can finish you off. Give me all the data you have. I'll try to adjust course. Okay. <laughs> Isaac, yeah, it's a terrible time to FaceTime, man. Like, I'll open up the bridge station. come on, man. We need to work on this together. was frayed pretty well, but then he just died. I've got no more healing on me right now. Need more stasis as well to make this a little easier. Uh, Hefna, what's up? Hey, it's the, uh, the hand cannon. You get rewarded for, you get rewarded it by completing the game on impossible difficulty without dying. flamethrower fuel and sell these semiconductors go ahead and get this bad boy and uh yeah we're pretty good pretty good i like it let's make a quick save here just to you know be safe just to be safe And we must carry on. To the bridge. Oh, how did you and wife meet? I met her at her workplace randomly one day, hanging out with friends, went to a, uh, the store and she was working there at the time. Yep. Ah, here we are at the bridge. Man, I gotta tell you, I feel like both Hammond and Kendra are stage five clingers at this point. They will not stop video calling me. Stage five clinger alert. How many fragments do I have now? Still two. And how does losing my team fit into this theory? Hey, knock this shit off. Into the debris field. You know what the video is called? It's um, it's a it says it's a live Q and A video, Davinus. We were playing um, Soulstone Survivors. So look for the Soulstone Survivors video on my channel. What was that look? What was that look, Kendra? Huh? That's a clearance level two. It's because you're their do boy, yeah. Ooh. 
Imagine we just outright killed it right there. Imagine. It'd be hilarious. Things got a little crazy there. I don't know why I have Christmas music stuck in my head out of nowhere, but you know, it is what it is. No, no, keep that rifle close. What is that? Ah, Chen. Hello there. I managed to travel. There's our boy. Face. I'm not seeing things, right? That's Chen. You can't help him, Hammett. He's... You're right. I should... The hell with it. Pod 47 launched. I worked with him for years. Johnston, too. At least she was spared becoming a monster. Same here, Hammer Man. We're gonna fix this, Hammett. For them. Yeah. Come on. The ADS cannons. I can hold this position for a while if no more asteroids come through the roof. Talk away, Hammond. Talk away. Here. All I can tell is the ADS power routing is shot. Well, the administration systems aren't doing much. We could redirect power from there. I'd need to rewire the junction boxes, but we get the ADS cannons back. Good. Isaac. Uh huh. I don't know about any illegal mining or the marker. I swear, I'm just here for a repair mission. Look, Hammond, I don't know you or Daniels well enough to judge, but CEC had to know about the marker. The company may have, but shit like that's above my pay grade. Look, we can get into it later. You'll need a way down to those junction boxes. You can turn the atrium elevators back on from security. You'll have full access. I found a CEC executive key card. I'll upgrade your clearance. And you upgraded yours already? Yeah, just in case. Just in case. And Isaac, I heard something up there. Something big. Watch your back. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, man. Ah, look at that. Clearance level two. Who? Hey, are you guys ready? You guys ready for the Brutes? Are you ready for Senor Brutus? <laughs> okay, this doesn't one-shot him. I don't have any stasis, do I? Rather unfortunate. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Alright, so they have a lot of armor and you can't actually one-shot them. That's... That's all right. That's all right. Clearance confirmed. Elevator control. Atrium elevators are now on. It's on the record, Doctor. This is brutal. The marker must 
This is mutiny. This is mutiny. <laughs> okay. We carry on. I wouldn't worry so much to Venus. Just kind of live your life, do your thing. Focus on yourself, you know? It'll happen naturally. All right, you guys need to come inside from the cold. I'll take that. Thank you. Ahead of you. Look at that contact beam. Watch your stuff. I wonder how the contact beam would do as far as ripping off flesh goes. It should do pretty well, right? Now, I'm not asking that without reason, chat. Don't don't look at me like that. Don't look at me weird. I'm asking because there's an achievement for damaging a limb on a necromorph and then ripping it off with kinesis. Don't look at me sideways like that. It's fine. Okay. I'll be able to really try this out when I can get more stasis. Yeah, I, the saw weapon might do okay too. Dead Space guy could defeat the Godskin duo? Yes. Specifically with the hand cannon. Alright, nothing to that. There's just a bench here, no worries. Zap. That is not an item. What's up, Red? Indeed, the foam finger, man. Indeed. Foam fingers too OP. Yeah, it definitely uh, trivializes the game for sure. But it doesn't mean it can't be a good time. All right. All right. Who in chat's screaming again? I told you about that shit. Relax. Relax. Bang, bang. Bang. Pew, pew. I can't even get my voice to go that high, man. Pew, pew. It just cracks. All right, it wants me to go that way, so let's check out the break room. Ah, oh, yes. This, these are normal things that happen. Ah, oh, the marker fragments. Yes, very good. There's our third one. So it is the same. 
That marker. That's the symbol of the Church of Unitology. You didn't take you for a believer, Isaac. My mother was. But if they found this on some alien planet, what does that mean? That Unitology's onto something? Unitology's full of shit. Forget it. All right, I had to stop and listen to that one because I didn't know if that was new dialogue or not. I can confirm that was not new dialogue. Screamer, that you were 16 months of membership here, man. One of the legit greatest streamers on the internet and he doesn't even realize it. Hit that like button to show Juice some love, folks. Thanks, man. I appreciate it, Screamer. Level three security clearance required. I think you were sticking with me all this time, too. You followed me over here from Twitch. I think you're staying with me for so long, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you, dude. I keep tapping R to reload. Thanks for not banning me. <laughs> All right, that guy popped in behind me. That's the main path. We don't want to go that way just yet. So we're going to go back here and I'm going to blast you. Oh, hey, that was one of the shadow guys. Or yeah, the, uh, the new enemies. I forget what they're called already. The Shadow Necroman Necromorph? Shadow Morph? <gasps> the Zaps! Oh no! Uh, Sharkbit, this is the, uh, the hand cannon. You get this for completing the game on the hardest difficulty without dying. Foam finger have unlimited ammo, or do you have to find ammo for it? Just wondering. It's unlimited, Tim. Unlimited. Okay, I'm seeing a power reroute from the electrical system. Just watch the outlets. The grid's unstable. That's two. One more system and we'll have power for the ADS. Doot, 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 doot. And give me your loot. Thank you kindly, sir. I appreciate it. Shark. Think of the six euros. 18 plus stream. Josh, finger bangs, unsuspecting bystanders. Oh my God. I'm sure the joke's been done, but I would hate myself if I didn't jump in on the opportunity. It's been said a few times, yeah. We are, we are also finger pewing. We are also finger pewing. Thank you, Shark, for the six euros, dude. They're a fucking horror show. These things mold any dead tissue into a new form. One kind infects corpses, and the rest... See, I frayed that so much, and yet it's still just... Hmm.
Ah, damn it. You see what I mean? It's not hard. I'm just not sure how to get that to work. It goes from not frayed to all the way frayed instantly. And then they just die. Hmm. Uh, Corbin, this is the level six suit. You get this um, by completing the game on any difficulty. The burnished suit is the one that you get for completing it on impossible difficulty. Make us whole, Isaac. Make us whole. And what's this one? Jacob, Master Override. You, but it is completely fucked. I'm not sticking around in case whatever did it comes back, and neither should you. It looks like the admin staff went to the mining deck to meet up with the other survivors. I'll head there too. Oh, wait, hold on. There's something to my side here. Please exit. I'll find a way to contact you. Ow. Uh, let's try... Okay, is there something behind me? No? Did I just do it? No, I don't think I did. This might be the way, though. Contact beam does a whole bunch of flesh damage. That might be it. Let's try this. Shark, thank you for six more euros, dude. Hands up if you just know Josh is having way too much fun with this and his 14-year-old giddy right now, internally laughing, going, wee! Yeah, you're right. I'm having a blast with it, dude. Auto targeting offline. Calibration data not found. I'm having a blast. Fuck. No auto targeting. <laughs> the cannons are useless. Thank you so but much for the six euros, man. You want to go out there with all that and shit? Is, thank you for the pound seventy nine. I've never watched The Expanse. Is it amazing? The Expanse is incredible and definitely my favorite live action TV show. Yes. Absolutely. I hope you know what you're doing. Absolutely. Thank you very much, Dovanus and Shark. I appreciate you guys. This is the Valor one? Yes, this is the Valor one that is suit level six. This is what you get for completing the game on any difficulty. What's the plan? I'll seek a few of the ADS cannons to one of my tools. Basically, you carry it into New Game Plus. We're out of options. Also fan of The Last of Us? I am. It's been going very well. All right, we need to remember there is a rig out here as well. Sinking targeting system. Calibration complete. Cannon auto targeting online. Did I not just see an enemy there? Oh my god, that's a whole asteroid. Okay, thank you for that. Sinking targeting system. Warning. Hull integrity compromised. Calibration complete. Cannon auto targeting online. Sinking targeting system. Data migration complete. ADS recalibrated. Auto targeting. Right, there's White's rig. Mr. White's. They're back. The ADS cannons are online shipwide. Thank God. Engaging autopilot. 
Get yourself inside, Isaac. I think I've figured out our next move. Something about the muffled space bangs that make it so much funnier? I know, dude. No one hears you bang and or pew in space? Question mark? Not even close. Not even close, dude. When I read about the limb thing, once the limb starts to dangle, that's when you rip it off. Yeah, the thing is, I've only actually seen it dangle once ever. I just intercepted a transmission from medical. Someone's down there? See what you make of this. <laughs> this is senior so, you can play impossible difficulty on new game plus you can if you def if you beat the game on impossible first becky you have to beat it on impossible to continue impossible nicole i'm going back to medical it makes sense i'll head to the crew deck and look for survivors from the bridge i'll be in touch the crew deck wonder if you know something you know <laughs> Fastest foam finger in the West. What's up, Jay Lee? First time I did this, I didn't listen or watch it, so I didn't po point and shoot and die trying to figure it out. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Pew pew bang. Are you guys ready? We you know what we could do in this moment, actually. Um. I don't have a whole lot of stasis, but level three security clearance required. I'm gonna try to do this thing. Give me that. Thank you. F F F I T W fastest foam finger in the West. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Super symmetry tether for the compact beam. Super symmetry tether. Well, we need that, don't we? Uh, let me go ahead and uh, move that to my inventory. I actually could use a little healing here. Let me sell some of this ammo. Let me go ahead and throw that in storage. Throw the line gun in storage. And we'll sell. No, 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 no. We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna keep that one. The line gun can be sold. All right. All right. I've not been in here yet. Found a gold semiconductor. That's good news. Does bang hit harder than pew? They both do the same damage. The difference is, is um, bang is on left mouse click and then pew is on space bar. It's considered the alt alternate fire, but they do the same thing. Now a 
Anything is magical. Pass to the chemical lab. What? You said the chemical lab? I, I can I can barely hear you. Uh, Balthazar, what's up? We are using the foam finger gun, but um, it's not exclusive to this. We're using other weapons too to try to get some achievements here and there. I didn't use the word only in the title specifically because I knew people would bring that up. What's really crazy is you can fire this really quickly, as you can see, and you can fire this really quickly, as you can see as well, but you can actually overlap them. You see that? So when it comes to specifically the, uh, the hunter and the brutes, I can really melt them quickly. Most things in the game are going to get one shot, but I think those those take more. So if I if I abuse the fact that they overlap and have no delay on the overlap, do massive damage really fast. Finally, stasis. Come on. Another stasis recharge. Okay, so I'm going to try to um, find a, an enemy here that I can stasis and then use the contact beam to make a limb dangle. The most attention I got in a while here. Oh, let's be real. Our community is much more friendly than you're giving it credit for. Oh, damn it. See? Like, it just kind of kills it. <laughs> it goes from non-frayed to just dead. Oh my god, what is happening with the camera? Alright, it's time to try the Ripper. Alright, that limb... Blew off. My bad. Uh, oh, whoop. Well, your whole head came off. All right. Well. All right. My bad. My bad, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
uh, PS4 to get the foam finger gun, you have to beat the whole game on the hardest difficulty without dying. Impossible difficulty. No deaths. Shark, they were five gifted members to the community, man. They were five gifted members to the community. That's really nice of you, dude. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Big. Let's see those cult emotes out there for the new non-cult members. Thank you, Shark. Thank you. Transmission override. Isaac Clark. Just a trick. Yeah, right on, Balthazar. Andrew, thank you for nine months at tier two. Says, ah, yeah, here we go again. Andrew, thank you for continuing your membership here, bud. Thank you. All right. I appreciate it. Dr. Brennan's nearest and dearest. We were colleagues, you know. Dr. Chalice. Mercy. Are you the reason the marker won't begin? That's it. Uh, convergence is installed. <laughs> She's meddling. How is the question? But even if I was to ask... For the majority of I enemies, suspect, yeah, Lucas. You're not the talkative type. And I haven't fully yes, explored... Bread loaf. ...the cause of death as that missing factor. Dismembered. Now, I think... On the right track there. <laughs> Try and relax, Mr. Clark. Convergence is so close. Maybe your death will tip the balance. Did you have a foam suit too? Imagine Trinidad. I am in no rush. So I guess now I should be because these guys. <laughs> I just joined how to get that suits. So you get it in new game plus after beating the game. It's the level six suits. Miss it. Oh, God. Every way out is locked down through one of the offices. It must be Mercer's. I can brute force the internal doors, but you will have to reach his office and lift the lockdown manually. I need to go find a bench. That's what I need. Yeah, no problem, Lee. Oh, yeah, bro.
do, do, do. This is the room in which you usually find the line gun, but if you already have it, then it won't be there. But obviously that's the line gun right there. So, you know, you can't, you can't grab it if you already have it. You can't dual wield them, unfortunately. That would be sick, but it's simply not allowed. Strictly illegal. Uh, we end up going down that pathway in just a few moments, so let's just go this way for now. Let's make a save. Yeah, it was pretty satisfying to do that, yeah. Ah, another marker, nice. What's that, our fourth, I think? Pretty good. Warning. Local protocols corrupted. Rebooting system. And a Ruby Change semiconductor. God damn. God damn. Who's there? Oh god. Hold on. I can help you. Not me. Save hydrocarbon. We're all dying. Just subscribed, happy to be part of the fam. Hey, X Legion, thanks for joining us, man. time will work if she just needs liquid nitrogen. Save us! Hey, I appreciate you being here when you can, Lucas. It means a lot, man. Air quality is dropping shipwide. Something's poisoning the oxygen and hydroponics. If we lose our air supply, please stand by. Someone could fix it. He came looking for liquid nitrogen, and there has to be some in the cryogenic slab. Okay. Not like we have a better option. I'll clear you a path to cryo. Door protocols rebooted. Thank you for your patience. <laughs> Take a short lift. Hey, can you just like stop? You know, can you just? Right out. Now we got this right here. Very nice. Okay, it's clearing. Mercer pumped that gas in from hydroponics. Is the air's already that bad? I'm gonna need a faster way to cryogenics. I'll open the other door from the chemical lab. It'll take you straight there. Now let me check out the store here. Let me check out the store. Ah, schematics for the line rack. Not that I need it. I'm going to hold on to my money for now. As I would rather make sure that we have enough for the other upgrades that we can get. I think there's what? Just the one more for the force gun? I think. Which I think is only like 11, 12k anyway, so it'll be fine, but just gonna hold on to the money for now. Do, do, do. What are the markers for? You need to collect them for a secret ending. It's a secret alternate ending that you can get during New Game Plus. I went the wrong way. The game gives you the hand cannon in impossible mode. You have to complete impossible mode in order to get it. After you beat impossible difficulty without dying, you can use the hand cannon in New Game Plus. 
and it might give you it might give it to you for new game as well i i can't recall i just know specifically for new game plus right now Do, 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 do. Oh, I hear the growling of the hunter. That's good. Called impossible. How is it possible? It's just hard mode, and it's basically just hard mode. And uh, if you die, then you have to restart. If you want to, you know actually get the rewards level three security clearance required they should have just took a coined a hardcore mode but you know it is what it is it's really not a big deal overall Hello, sir. Now he's just going to be talking, talking, talking forever. Come on, man. Is the impossible suit like level seven or cosmetic? It's cosmetic. Even it's called the burnished car, suit. A convergence event fueled it looks pretty cool. I like the level six suit a little bit more, but the burnished suit's pretty dope as well. Humanity will be made whole, Mr. Clark, with or without you. I'd say you chosen your side. Initiating cryogenic freeze. Bastard, let me out again. Uh, Jay Lee, to get this suit, you have to beat the game, and then you can equip it in New Game Plus. And it costs ninety-nine thousand credits. Hammond since he went to the crew deck. Isaac, our air quality is falling fast. If you've got liquid nitrogen, we gotta fix hydroponics. Want it. Keep trying to reach Hammond. Mercer. I need the item in there. Done yet. Open the door, please. Oh, what's this purple glow? Oh, hey, that's nice. Look at that. Another marker fragment just chilling there. Neat. I mean, there's our tissue sample. Very good. Careful. Who knows what mad science went into that thing? Maybe I could find out. Figure out what Mercer's up to. If I'm fast, there has to be a DNA scanner close by. Isaac, the hydroponics tram station is sealed off. You'll need another way there. Take the tram back towards the hangar, then head to the repair station. Remember where you took that broken tram car off the track? There's an access door in there that'll take you hydroponics. <laughs> Man got his skull pops. No, Mr. Bug, no worries on revealing the locations of the uh, the things, man. If I miss them, I miss them. That's okay. I won't actually complete the playthrough until I find them all anyway. 
If I have to go back and backtrack and stuff, I'm fine with that. I'm sure I've already missed at least one anyway at this point. I'm planning on having to backtrack anyway because I want to get all the upgrades and stuff in a single playthrough. So that means that I have to backtrack to get all the, uh, the master override doors and uh, containers. So it's all good. It was all a dream. I used to read Word Up magazine. Every time I say it's all good, it reminds me of that song. It's all good, baby, baby. Hangar cargo tram control. This is the uh, the word salad area. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Anyways, where to? Tram station hall. Hmm. A little bit of a bathroom break here. Grab the items. Thank you kindly. All right, I know where we are. This is uh, pretty close to the beginning of the game. Very good. You don't say. I'm reading a huge mass in food storage. Too big to be anything they grow. It looks like the source of the poison gas. That patient in medical. He said something about creating an enzyme, right? Maybe the scientists... I really enjoy the level design of this game. Station now accessible. How you can, like, go from one area to another just walking and then open up these trams and it just kind of, like, makes sense in your mind and how it's all connected, you know? I appreciate it a lot myself because it's generally something that um, I have a hard time really putting all this stuff together a lot of the time myself in my own head. So the, the level design in this actually allows me to do so pretty well. Which tells me it's a pretty clean setup. Simple and intricate simultaneously. Pretty cool. De Balthazar, becoming a member of the channel. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much for doing that. I really appreciate that level of support. It means a lot, dude. I hope you enjoy the emotes you can use in chat as well as my videos. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. Better alien killer, Isaac Shepard or Master Chief? I have to go with Shepard. I have to go with Shepard. This is Dr. Elizabeth Cross. To all survivors, turn back. Been here for half a year, might as well join the cult. Hey, thank you for joining us, man. It means a heck of a lot. Nitrogen supply depleted. Liquid nitrogen replenished. Beginning enzyme synthesis. Enzyme synthesis complete. Caution. Do not ingest. Our credits just jumped up to 50,000. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Synthesis complete. Please retrieve enzyme from workstation. Yeah, it's the not cult. Thank you very much. Yes. Any luck? No cult here. No cult activities here. Thanks. They must have been trying to kill whatever's in food storage. Shepard killed all those poor fish. He did, man. No, 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 no. Go back. There's no way into food 
storage. Even if it was the Leviathan would devour you. Elizabeth Cross, right? This Leviathan, is that what's poisoning the air? The air. My team has destroyed everything. I designed a special enzyme to kill it. I just needed liquid nitrogen to complete the synthesis. But the people I sent to medical. Whoops. Never came I'm back. dropping shit. My bad. Some of that enzyme here. Oh my god. How? Listen. We need to inject it into the Leviathan. You can't get into food storage, but there's another way. It's risky. Riskier than running out of air? My team has been altered. Let me at him, dude. Let me at him. The enzyme will be carried right into the Leviathan's heart. Find the Weezers. You know you have a Weezer right behind you, right? Like you guys, you guys see to her to the to the back right of the video. There's a Weezer behind her. She's just like chilling next to it. Why would you even stay there, man? Why would you even stay there? How do you play New Game Plus on Impossible? I don't get that option for New Game Plus. Only can go up to hard mode. You have to complete the game on Impossible first, Nokota. If you don't complete the game on Impossible, then you can't New Game Plus Impossible. You can only Impossible New Game Plus from the same save of Impossible. It doesn't work otherwise. The Ripper upgrade. Thank you very much. That is clearance three over there. All right, flamethrower upgrade, Ripper upgrade, Ripper upgrade. Contact beam upgrade. And let's see. Pulse rifle, plasma cutter. This one. Contact beam. Alright, I'm gonna level up the contact beam. Oh, I didn't even consider secondary fire damage with this one. Increases size of secondary fire's projectile. All right. When you, I don't know if you guys have ever done it before, but when you max out the contact beam, it is actually an insanely powerful weapon. Like it is ridiculous. You make it so the ammo lasts a long time and it's just a continuous stream of incredibly flesh like ripping damage it's so good Let's try to, uh, speaking of, let's try to, um, rip off some limbs in this room, shall we? All right, too much damage too quickly. Too much. No! 
Now you see that? How it just kind of killed that very quickly? Hey, what's up? How you doing? Don't do that. Look at that, dude. You're looking a little bloody there, friend. You good? Well, you survived that, huh? too much again all right all right the ripper doesn't really show a whole lot of actual flesh damage happening like it doesn't actually fray the skin like other weapons do it seems and i don't know why you would think that it would make the most sense there for it to happen, and yet it doesn't. Security request retrieved. Hello, security. This is Dr. Cross in hydroponics. Something just hit the hole near storage. The contact beam does a little bit too much too fast. Here's our force gun. Uh, let's throw on the force gun and see if this will do it for us. It's our final hope. Toxic Have some enzyme, friend. See how it like blows their body apart though? Isn't that crazy? It wasn't dangling there, unfortunately, but that was our closest bet so far, I think. By the gravity well, it doesn't do much damage. The gravity well is a bit too little damage. Even when you upgrade it, the damage isn't good on it. The force gun itself doesn't do a whole lot of damage. It's just kind of like the main use of it in, in this game is to blow off armor from the enemies. 
that's why you get it at this point in the game because right about now is when you would start seeing a lot more armored enemies in general Like this guy you see how it blew all the armor off him so ideally you would uh you know blow the armor off of him and then hit him with any other weapon so that way you could just take him out faster It's Harry. And we should find a force gun upgrade here, too. 12,000. I'll take that, thank you. And then we will go in here and sell some other stuff. Let's go ahead and start buying a ton of these power nodes now. I'm at the point in the game where I have all the weapons and I've purchased all the store based upgrades. So literally every cent I get from here on out should go into power notes. Hmm, I wonder how this will do. Not ideal. I feel like these guys have some really easily terrible limbs, and it's why I was trying to really focus on them there, but it didn't work out for me. All right, let's make a save. Hey, Swap, welcome back. But okay, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go ahead and stop the stream here. We're about halfway through the game. It's a good spot to leave off. When I come back tomorrow, we're going to try to wrap up this playthrough. I'm going to try to find the rest of the the marker fragments so that way we can get the alternate ending sound good i just checked you have to just rip it off with kinesis not kill them with the limbs oh i know suzanne the thing is is you have you can't just rip off a limb with kinesis until it's weakened you have to get the limbs to a weakened state so that way you can rip it off with kinesis in general and that's what i'm having a difficult time getting to yeah you are right but we can't rip it off without weakening the limb first and all the weapons seem to have different variations in which they can damage the limbs and trying to find like the balance in that is the tough part but uh ladies and gentlemen i'm out of here for now i'm gonna go i'm gonna go chill eat some food and hang out with wife sound good i'll be back again tomorrow you'll get eventually i hope so i hope so i'll be back tomorrow at 4 p.m eastern time to continue this playthrough even if we don't get that specific achievement, we'll be able to get the New Game Plus achievement, and that's fine by me. That's fine by me, because I can work on the other ones at any other time. That's fine. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. Thank you for chilling with me tonight. I really appreciate your company. Thank you for leaving a like, and of course, uh, thank you for subscribing to the channel. I will see you all tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. Until then, be excellent to each other. Have a great night. I'll see you soon.